Carmelos. Thank you so much for visiting my channel. I really hope you're having a beautiful and an amazing day. This is a timeless collective reading for the sign of Aquarius. Magic, magician, the tower. This person, like I said, they found a loophole. This person thought that they were going to trick you into joining the dark side with them. That was the plan, to trick you. Knight of Wands. Death. This is going to come about quickly. The moon here and the empress. And the high priestess, the fool, the sun. This divine feminine is a high priestess. Free yourself, divine feminine, and go towards this new life and towards this new divine partner. This person who rushes in and out of your life with all of these illusions, they must face their, their judgment, their karma. You now will have to watch this person walk to their own death. Just the way that they watched you be walk, walked to yours. You need to stop trying to protect this person. This is the law of karma. Do unto others what you want done unto you. They watched you. They walked with you. And they, I'm seeing like, I don't know, like some of you, they, they, they watch somebody stone you, behead you, assassinate you. They now must walk to their death. And there's no amount of magic, money, clout, friend, family. There's nothing that can stop this. This person is shocked. Because at some point they did awaken to what was going on in their life. Oh, I think I figured it out now. But they still were unwilling to admit. This is also for some of you, someone in your life. They have sat amongst you at your table and around you knowing what they did or this is the energy for some of you of friends and family they knew what was happening to you and they never ever said anything this is someone who refused to open up their mouth and say listen this may be really hard for you to hear and you may not ever talk to me again or whatever the case but i need to tell you the truth someone here refused to confess their sins Yeah, that page of cups still fell out. This person can't believe this because there was an offer that this person made. Some of you, this person, whatever kind of magic or whatever they would, they made some kind of offer. They could have been working with some kind of deity or something where they thought it was going to get them out of a situation. They could also be a part of this loophole where this person felt like, well, I can let everything go through with divine feminine being attacked, assassinated or whatever. And then to pay for my sins, I'll just make an offering. This deity will get me off. No, it's not. You did this towards a divine feminine who's a high priestess. This sun card here, this is not, this, this isn't the, the typical child on the sun card. This is someone here who has fully evolved and ascended you didn't just start your journey <laughs> somebody honestly thought that they would create the illusion that they were apologizing to you or that they meant you well and they would get you caught in something yeah they will come towards you with an offer get you caught up in a situation emotionally or whatever allow you to be hurt and caught up in the crossfire of, of whatever this is. And then they will just make an offering to whatever or whoever they worship. In hell, of course. The devil, I would say. And that they will just get them off. No. None of the cheat codes are working. The elevator between from hell to earth to heaven. It's jammed. It doesn't work. The cheat codes don't work. You can see this person shape-shifting. None of it works. This person must now fall on their own sword. If this is a deceased person, their spirit, 
can't jump around because this person's soul is stuck. No, they have to bow down and face their judgment. Somebody here is trying to run away from the fact that what they did against you, they, they're wanting to use the excuse that they were convinced to do it. But that just that, that's not your fault or your problem. They failed their mission. They should have known better. But they didn't. The wheel of fortune just fell out in the reverse. So yeah, there's no coming back from this. And none of these cards are in the reverse. Wow. Knight of Pentacles. Hangman. A lot of, some of you, you have a new person entering your life who is awakened. This person also, for some of you, this person who went against you, they received, yeah, confirmation. That you have someone new coming in your life who is very much enlightened. You have a new contract here. And that's also how this person knows that their time is up. I guarantee you, for some of you, this person is somewhere in the world right now. They're already preparing for some type of ending. They're afraid because you have a new contract. So obviously, whoever you are in a contract with, they receive your protection. That means that the, this person that's been holding on to your energy, that's the only thing that's keeping them alive. That's it. When you decide to make peace with the fact that this person cannot be a part of your path and you cut that cord, you cut their air off. And again, this is karmic justice. This is this is this is principle. You cannot feel guilty about this. It's you or them. This person will let you bleed out and die. That's what they did in the past life. That's what they were willing to do this lifetime if it meant that they were going to gain something. This person thought that they were going to gain something from hurting and harming you. But they stuck around watching you monitoring you spying on you spiritually paying other people to spy on you as long as they get what they want they don't really care yeah they have some type of love for you at some point but their love for what they thought they could gain from hurting you was far greater than the love that they ever had for them actually being with you and them being in the light. The Hermit card is here. We have full moon in Virgo right now. You're going within or something here is about to make a lot of sense for you. Justice. And look at all these birds here on this person. Somebody here knows the truth. They're receiving confirmation that karmic justice is here. And everything that they sent out. It's coming back. This person, like I said, look at this lion here. It's tired. This person, the, the, the jig is up. This, their chariot isn't going anywhere. They have no, no way out. Look at that. The emperor and the hierophant. This is someone's masculine. You were willing to protect this person. This emperor and this hierophant. This hierophant now... It's, they're not confused, but they know nobody is listening to them. They can't make an offer to anything or anyone to save them. Yeah. All because they held back the truth. This pentacle here was their way out. This pentacle was the offer. Had they made you this offer or had they confessed their sins to you, they would have had protection, sovereignty, and freedom, but they didn't. And you have someone here in your life, King of Wands, Temperance. You have a new masculine that's coming into your life that knew all along that this magic against you was not going to work. This is that other energy that has been watching you, making sure that you were safe and protected. Somebody else has been sitting back just waiting on Judgment Day, waiting on justice to be served. 
this other there's a masculine here who has been defending you in the spirit they've taken a few blows but they knew that this cycle was going to come to an end and that you were going to be that you were going to ascend higher because you were chosen to do this you were chosen to be this divine feminine this beautiful being that you are and you were also chosen to be with this beautiful chosen divine masculine as well the one that was in your life that chose to go against you that's it king and queen of swords you and someone have both been working together in the spirit you could have been separated from this person but the both of you are like spiritual psychic investigators in the spirit realm. You are spiritual psychic investigators and judges in the spirit realm. And now judgment must be called on this person that was very immature. Who kept going after you, kept on just attacking you. You've already escaped the matrix. It's all over. You've grown. You've evolved. You've ascended. Here we have, look. Somebody here wanted to paint illusions. They tried to make themselves look like they were good, faithful, innocent, committed, like they had your best interest at heart, and they didn't. And now that the illusion is gone, they are very, very shook now. Because the whole time, you had angels, you had God in the background making sure that whatever this offer was that this person held back from you, or whatever the offer was that this person thought they were going to steal from you, it was protected the whole time. The thing is, is that the offer that you have, that this person, that they did not accept, it was, it was, it was for their own life. This person forfeited their life because you are their, you're the only thing keeping them here. This person jumped to their own death when they decided to go against you. Look at this. The devil. They've been caught. It's over. It's a wrap. The devil here is in chains. And you see these two people here that have this? You guys, you have a counterpart for you. It may not be the person that you thought it was. But you and someone else have been in, <laughs> in sync mind body spirit soul in the 5d working together to make sure that here in the 3d that you are protected because you are indeed the supreme divine feminine yeah page of pentacles somebody here was holding on to this pentacle with their feet they were not letting it go at all this is a new offer for you Somebody knew that they needed to complete, like value you, honor you, and protect you because of what you carry. You carry certain gifts, and, and, and it's, it's this level of protection that's out of this world. The worst of the worst can be protected if they are in your good grace and they are connected to you. And that's what this person knew. But somebody thought that they were going to use and abuse your shields of protection and then discard you later. This is a narcissist. But the tower here, divine intervention. There is an end of one contract here and the beginning of a new contract. One where you can be totally in your purpose. All of your hopes, wishes, and dreams. The lover speaks of a choice. You're leaving one partnership behind and starting a new one. You're going to look good and feel good doing it. Queen of Wands and the Star. You've manifested a brand new reality for yourself. But I'm telling you now. <laughs> some of you, the only reason why this person is still standing is because... Your heart is still loyal and this person in some kind of way is connected. Like they, they're still very much attached to you. And I, for, for some people, this isn't a twin flame. This is someone who has possibly done spell work to bind themselves to you. That just came to me. Some of you, this isn't your twin flame. It may have felt that way. 
this person is someone who is very karmic, very toxic, low vibrational. This person, they decided to bind themselves to you so that they will be protected. You need to free yourself from whatever this binding spell is. Simply just pray. Yep. This person has for sure decided to bind themselves to you so that they could take part in your spiritual protection. Because everything that they've done in the background against you. They've been getting away with it because they have their protection. They have their connection to you. Some of you, this is a very strong like soul tie that has been formed for some of you even through sex. You need to, you need to break this. This person here for some of you is a stalker. They spy on your social media. They're very jealous of the attention that you receive from other people. Copycat trying to be just like you and everything that you do. It says here, your ex is preying on the downfall of your new love interest. So like I said, for some of you, this is an ex. This person is watching you, stalking you, spying on you. They're probably even trying to be like a person that is in your life or like the person that's about to enter your life. They want to appear to be anything good that you may be interested in because they refuse to let you go. But I tell you what, when you let them go and you make peace with the fact that this person is truly a spiritual assassin who had a job to get rid of you, you won't have to worry about them anymore. Blocked heart chakra. This is someone here who has caused your, your heart chakra to be blocked. Because of how bad they hurt you. Causing you dizzy spells, blurred vision, nosebleeds, and loss of hearing. Th th these are all symptoms of someone also trying to block your third eye. It says a co-worker is two-faced. They are turning others against you. I'm only going to pull a few of these. You may want to use Black Sage. It says it has the power to draw your energy and consciousness into other realms. It's protection for um, astral traveling. This person has caused you to have flu symptoms, fever, chills, head colds, congestion. What did I say? Blocked crown chakra and hating on your spiritual psychic gifts. Causing you to feel tired. Misery loves company. This person is miserable, so they watch you, they stalk you, they spy you. They know that they chose some kind of copycat energy over you. And this person, they will be, they will lose everything. Possibly their life for what they did. The only thing that's stopping this from happening is the fact that you're still in denial about the fact that they are the ones doing all of this stuff to you. High honor. You are a person of high honor. You're still in total disbelief that this person would do the things that they've done to you. You don't want to believe it. When you stop being in denial about this, you will receive your justice. You're expecting high honor and a new love offer. So this person has come in to attack you once again. And I'm telling you, this person, they are willing to get rid of you. Child. You have new love. You have a new child or a new beginning coming into your life. And it's going to be things of great greatness, high honor. You worked hard for this toil and labor. All of the things that you went through, it wasn't in, in vain. But again, you, you have to accept this situation for what it is. Some of you, you just, I'm telling you, you, you do not want to accept the fact that this person that you loved, adored, and that you care for, that they have been the person in the background, literally, calling shots to get rid of you. And it is a lot of past life energy because this person did this to you in a past life. And in this lifetime, they were supposed to protect you, to right their wrongs from a past life. And I feel like that's what they started out doing. And then when the jealousy and the greed and everything else came about, when they felt like you was you was too high up on your horse and other people had a problem with the way this person 
protected you, tried to honor you and love you. They got in this person's head and this person quickly turned against you. They went right back to their old ways. Therefore, now they have to pay the karma for what they did in this lifetime and the previous lifetime. They just couldn't get it right. And it's like your spiritual team is like, let me, let me have them. Let me have them. And you're like, no, I don't think it's them. That's my twin flame. I love them. The karmic is the reason why they did it. Stop making excuses for this person and let them get this work. Let them get it. How the hell are you going to try to kill somebody in several lifetimes? What? No, let them, let them have exactly what they are doing. Just a, you've worked hard to be a privileged lady. This person wants to rob, steal, kill, and destroy. That's it. Anything else? I don't have, you know, God may have. God has mercy for all of us, but a mature man is here. A mature man is possibly in despair. <laughs> person your your mercy for this person is the reason why they're constantly being safe because the energy that i'm just like how is this person they're constantly escaping these endings some of you will notice that even around the moon cycle this person is constantly attacking you and you're asking well how is it that they they're constantly able to do this to me it's because you still won't accept the fact that it's them doing it courthouse official person mature man some of you there's a mature person who's official they could even work in the courthouse or something or someone in the court system somebody's gonna be you're gonna receive great fortune and more security and stability the mature woman is here with gift The coffin card is here too, and despair, occupation, sudden will. This coffin, to me though, this is an ending that's bringing about a major transformation and a rebirth. Someone is in despair about this because you have put in work to receive sudden wealth, and this person and these other false people in your life, I mean, they're... They have to deal with their own bad health, poverty, and despair. 